The Red Cross estimated that nearly 2,000 workers died annually in the U.S. lumber industry, with about 8,300 permanently disabled and over 70,000 temporarily disabled. One company reported over 2,500 injuries related to sawmills and logging among the approximately 4,500 employees from September 1912 to September 1914 with an annual accident rate of over 25%. Although logging in the U.S. experienced strong development over the years, workplace accidents in this industry were a major obstacle to the overall development of the U.S. economy. So today, let's explore how the phases of wood development in the U.S. will unfold. The U.S. timber industry is divided into three paces of development. The first phase of the U.S. wood industry began in 1620 when the first European settlers arrived in search of minerals and wood resources. The Native Americans used wood to build houses, make household items and produce food. With their movement of Europeans, the dependent on wood increased significantly to serve the construction of cities, railroads, ships, and other works. By 1700, the timber industry had become an essential part of the U.S. economy. By the late 18th and 19th centuries, sawmills had also appeared in the U.S., helping to increase productivity and production strength. People began to use equipment, tools, and machinery to bring the used timber industry into the industrial age. In 1880, the timber industry began to develop with investment in industrial wood production facilities, replacing manual production. The use of machinery and new production technology increased productivity and efficiency while reducing production costs. The second stage of the history of development of the U.S. wood industry began in the 1880 and lasted until 1945. During this period, the U.S. wood industry developed significantly, including the exploration and use of various types of wood. The U.S. wood industry made significant strides during this stage, thanks to the use of new technology and mass production. This helped to increase productivity and reduce costs. Some popular wood products produced during this period included plywood, veneer, hardwood flooring and furniture. However, the logging process during this period also caused a lot of damage to the environment and human health. During the logging process, forests and the living areas of animals were severely destroyed. In addition, Workers in the wood industry also face many hazards, including workplace accidents, chemical toxicity and pollution.
conducted in 2012 showed that about 80,000 people were killed or injured in the logging process in the United States from 1816 to 1945. In addition, logging also caused many environmental problems including loss of biodiversity, reduced crop yield and impacts on water quality. From 1945 to present day, the US wood industry has undergone significant changes and development. After World War II, the wood industry became an important part of the US economy and contributed to the many different fields such as construction, furniture, manufacturing and paper and cardboard, etc. In the 1950s and 1960s, more advanced technology was applied in wood production, especially with the development of machinery and automation. New techniques and equipment such as surface coating materials, interlocking flatlands and other advanced techniques were applied to the industry to increase productivity to improve product quality. In the 1970s and 1980s, the US wood industry faced many challenges, including competition from other countries and environmental and regulatory issues. However, the US wood industry continued to develop and contribute to the country's economy. By 2020, the estimated volume of wood harvested in the United States reached 440 million cubic meters, of which 65% were from plantation forest and 35% were from natural forests. Although plantation forests accounted for a high proportion, logging in the use was still subject to strict regulations to ensure sustainable development and minimize environmental impact. Since its establishment, the wood industry of the United States has made significant contributions to the country's economy, with its large scale and considerable development over more than two centuries, the U.S. wood industry has become of one of the most important sectors from the U.S. economy. The U.S. production always ranked first in the world and makes significant contribution to the national budget. The wood industry creates millions of jobs for American citizens, contributes to economic growth and attracts investment in field of wood production and processing. What do you think about the development and exploitation of wood in the United States in this video? Let us know your thoughts in the comment section of this video. Goodbye and see you in the next video.